Hey everyone, so in this video, we're gonna see how you can go from a terrible LinkedIn inbox management experience to something that is great to drive conversation and to close deals faster. So let's cut the BS and let's go straight into it. So the first thing is that you should not use the LinkedIn inbox um, of LinkedIn because LinkedIn is a social media platform. It's not a CRM, it's not a focused LinkedIn inbox. So the first step is that you need to pick a LinkedIn inbox focus tool. So this is what a LinkedIn focus tool look like. Um, this is Brackle sales CRM. So it's a sales CRM where you can integrate social media, uh, but also email. And you see right now it looks already so much better. Um, I can have like my different uh, LinkedIn contacts on the left. And in the middle here, I have my LinkedIn conversation, but um, it's go it goes beyond the regular LinkedIn inbox because you can have notes here. You can reply to your own notes, type team members. Uh, but the most important thing, if you want to have a better LinkedIn inbox management is that here I have all my different LinkedIn conversation. But if I click on this button, show only the messages from my leads, I would just see the leads that are inside the software. Because the problem with like the current LinkedIn inbox in terms of management is that it's um, very clunky. Um, you need to go through all your leads, find the right person and reach out to them. But here, I just want, um, I can just focus on my leads. So you see right here, it's just the leads I have in the CRM. Now I go back to all my conversation, et cetera, et cetera. So very convenient um, to do. The second thing that you can do to have a proper LinkedIn inbox uh, management system in place is that you can create leads from your inbox. So right here, um, you see I am in this conversation with Adam. And uh, the thing we can notice is that um, Adam is not inside the CRM yet. So if I click back on here, you see I don't see Adam. Uh, so I'm going to be able to add the lead inside the CRM straight away. And now once I've done that, you're going to see that um, I can manage where Adam is in my sales pipeline in just one click. And so from there, you can say, oh, um, actually, this lead is interested. And uh, from there, you can apply filters to just uh, be organized and go through uh, your inbox management super easily every day, like 10 minutes for engaged leads, 10 minutes for interested leads, etc., and back and forth. Um, so that is like the, the second thing. Um, the third thing that you can do if you want to have a proper uh, workflows and inbox management system in place is that when you have a conversation with a lead, what you can do is that you can create, you can click on this button here, task, and imagine you want to follow up Adam um, because, um, you know, like you just want to, to get this cell going. So I'm going to write like follow up Adam. I'm going to like say it's for next week and I'm going to add um, the reminder right here. So I'm going to click on add reminder. Now I've clicked on add reminder and inside my CRM, like my management system, when I go to my task, so basically what I have to do every single day to be productive, um, you see, I have a task um, with the due date and I have this little, uh, like link button here. This task is linked to a message. So if I click on this button, follow up Adam, the link button, it's going to take me directly inside the right conversation. And then I can just follow up uh, using one of my templates, uh, because when you follow up people, most of the time you have something ready to go and that's it. Super easy. But actually I can go even beyond that. So let's say actually um, let's do another task um, with someone else. So with one of my other leads, uh, let's do um, this one with Mohan here. So Mohan, for example, uh, here is a customer. And so we're going to create a task um, that says um, like, like follow up for a referral, like to get a testimonial because it's, it's a happy customer. And I'm going to say it's for next week. We're going to add a reminder. And so we have a conversation. We can do it from one place. Uh, we can put him uh, in a in specific um, sales partner stage. And then when I go back to my task, to what I have to do every single day, and I just execute, I don't think like brainless system, I click here. So the same system of uh, like Adam before, I click here, it will prompt me 
to do my task, which is to follow up uh, like Mohan. And what's going to happen is like, uh, you see on the, on the top right, I have a couple of buttons here. So I have like my task, uh, if I click here, um, that I need to do, uh, I can see my past social interaction right here. It's empty and I have like feed. And if I click on feed here, you're going to see that, um, like basically all his LinkedIn posts have been aggregated. And what it means in terms of sales, in terms of LinkedIn inbox management to get more replies, to avoid being ghosted, um, to just make things happen faster is that right before sending my follow-up asking for a referral, I can bond with the prospect even more to stay top of mind, to be more likable by engaging with his LinkedIn post. So I can like the post and I can also command the LinkedIn post super easily from one place. And if I'm not satisfied with the first post, I can just scroll through and see like something that is interesting. And then you see like it just announced that right here announcement type. Like it just announced that um, now he's part, um, he's founded his own company, his own agency. Um, yeah, Spring Drive, you see? And so I can follow up right here. And in my follow up on the right, I have a post that I've just engaged with on LinkedIn, like liking, commenting it. And I can like say, PS, congrats on launching like Spring Drive Men. And you see like this, you can have, you can spice things up by adding uh, more personalization to the process, being more relevant. You can use that uh, linking it back to your offer uh, if, the, if the deal is not closed. So basically this is all the steps that you can do to have a better LinkedIn inbox management. Um, it's very easy to do uh, in terms of time you can save every day. It's uh, mind blowing and you can also obviously uh, work as a team and connect multiple LinkedIn accounts if you want to manage uh, like the accounts of your teammates or if you want to manage the accounts of your clients or maybe having a VA doing this on your behalf. So that's pretty much about it for um, this um, video. Um, if you have any question, make sure um, to leave a comment in the, in the section. Thanks.